Hey, how you doing? This is Michael from AplusOnSiteNC.com with a tutorial on how to take a hard drive out and put it back in. Okay, say we just want to replace this hard drive, not add another one. What we would do is, first off, we would locate the computer, lay it on its side, take the side of the case off properly, which on this one is a little release button and the very back, and it slides off. And so we take the one uh, screw holding the bracket in, and uh, potentially there might be one on the bottom. You might have to take the face of the case off and remove a screw, depending on what brand, make, and model of computer you have. This one, the hard drive holder just kind of hinges out and drops down a little bit, and you're able to get the old hard drive out, which is a little dusty. And what we would do, if we were going to take this one totally out, and replace it with another one is you'll see that there's a screw here holding it in this bracket there's a screw here and a screw here we would remove them replace it and put it back in the same way that this one was in there and we would undo the IDE cable which is here and we would re-jumper to drive this one's mastered and we would unplug and plug the power which is keyed this is a mo molar uh, connector here and we would reconnect the power, re-jumper the new drive, put the IDE cable back on properly. Notice these little tips on the little bracket here for the hard drive. We would reinsert it, put it in, and we should be good to go. We would just need to put our screw back in to hold it properly in our case. Which is sometimes easier than said. There we go. We just slide it over a little bit. screw to hold this bracket in. Voila. Now you've uh, put your hard drive in. You'll need to reinstall your operating system on your new hard drive or transfer any data onto this drive after you get Windows reinstalled from your old one. Thank you for watching our tutorial on how to remove and reinstall a hard drive.